attribute uh, your sense of courage and uh, you know your exploration as a result of which you arrive at certain takes uh, you know to life because uh, it's interesting that you talk about nuance and flattening because I'm seeing it all the time as mm. somebody who was part of broadcast media and now trying to do independent digital media it's always a choice to flatten and therefore reach out to more or appeal to more I, you know I've never wanted to appeal to too many people but to reach out you know that's the temptation or to go nuance and wonder if you will, you know, how many people will you interest with the, with your choice of guest, with your choice of what interests you. Yeah. Um, how do you, what, where does, where, what would you attribute the courage of your convictions to? I don't think of myself as a courageous person, frankly. But I think it's also this, you know, like freedom's just another word for nothing left to lose. Yeah. I don't have anything to lose. Like, I wasn't rich. I'm not famous. Mm. I'm not. You have no agenda. No, I mean, I have a gender to be able to express myself. To, I mean, all I mm. want is to be able to make the work I make always, right? Mm. That's all I'm searching for. Like, everything I do is only in order to be able to make the work I make in the way that I like to make it mm. forever if I can. Mm. Right? So that's what I'm always searching for. And whatever gives me that possibility, I do it. If I don't get money to make a film, which I do find very hard. Like, it's very hard for me to get money to make the kind of films I want. I always mm. do it in some, like, backdoor way <laughs> because actually nobody wants... Like, you did a film on Bandra. Yeah. Uh, Bandra. Sandra from Bandra. Yeah, which then, where's, ba where's, where's Sandra, Sandra, isn't yeah, it? Yeah. And it became about Sandra, and it became about women, and yeah. it became about me. And I was like, I was watching the film, and I said, you know, uh, my conversation with Paro, I hope we are both a bunch of, we are both a couple of Sandras in that yeah, conversation. Like I'm a Sandra, for sure. Yeah. So, you know, my thing is, ki, achha, abhi, you're going to give me money for something, and I can make what I want to make it, and then I'll make it, you know. But the thing is, it is definitely easier if you're going to make a film in yeah. which, like, women are heroes mm. or victims. You know, that is still easier. Mm. No matter what anybody says, that is the ultimate truth. If you make such a picture, you will get a lot of money from outside. You don't have to pay money right? So actually, I am unique in that all my films are made with money from India. <laughs> but it always comes back door, back door and a lot of like very little money. <laughs> Celebrate and, Bandra. Yeah, and then, you know, cooking nice meals and feeding your friends and saying, please, let's shoot a little bit. And of course, those friends and those crew members who have the same set of beliefs yeah, in art, yeah, right? Yeah. So it's not that I am something exceptional, so they did it for me. Mm. You know, this is the other thing, that the cult of the male filmmaker, mm. which always says that I am such a great seer mm. that people wish to serve my vision. But I don't think so. I think that there are incredible people in the world right. who share your vision. Right. So you are lucky if you meet them and for some time you can come together and they help you realize your vision, right? So that is a fantastic lucky thing because I could not get this chance. But I'm like, Where ko chance mil Chalo, hai. I would like to get one crore, but abhi paanch lakh mera to jali se bana de, right? You know, that kind yeah, of thing. Yeah. So I feel like it's really that I just want to say things as they are. For me, that is the biggest power in the world. Thank you.